here is Bujo Duke, Duke Ironman champion. First of all, congratulations. Yeah, thank you. A uh, hard fought victory. Tell us a little bit about that finals match. Uh, sorry, say that again. Uh, hard fought victory. Tell us a little bit about that finals um, match. I went in there confident. Uh, definitely prepared for this match. Ever since last year, I suffered that injury. It's definitely motivated me to come win this tournament again. It's such a great tournament. It's a great environment, and I just love wrestling. So. Speaking of injury, what happened to your shoulder in that match? Uh, I, so, in the first period, when I was trying not to give up the one, and I was driving the mountain, I had my arm extended. I mean, it kind of just popped a little bit. And uh, I couldn't really reach with this arm. It was about, I felt like it was about to pop like four times in those last two periods, but I did my best to try to keep it down. And, Avoid it. Did you want to face Lockett here? Uh, definitely. Um, I mean, he suffered a, a close loss in the match before, but I mean, we'll deserve to be here. He beat him. So. New York hasn't had a huge presence at the Ironman. They just let you guys in in the last 10 years. Yeah. The tournament's like 25, 30 years almost old. Uh, being one of the first, we think you're the first New York guy ever to win Ironman. That's <laughs> just talking to the tournament director. That's pretty cool. To know that, like, you're probably the first guy to ever do it. I know we had a finalist, like, eight years ago or something. Yeah? To beat, to beat, you're the second guy? Second guy. They, they weren't sure, but you're the second guy to win it. What's it like knowing that, that you're uh, the second guy in New York ever to do it? Uh, it's definitely pretty cool. I've been in New York my whole life, and uh, it's a great place. Um, it's pretty cool to represent New York and come out here and win. Maybe uh, motivate some of the youth wrestlers in our area, try and wrestle, come better in. Like How much these. did you heard about the Ironman growing up in New York? Uh, I never really heard about it. I mean, I followed a lot of guys, like older guys like Yanni and Vita and all those guys. When I was, when I was little, so um, I'm pretty sure they didn't compete here. So I didn't know too much about it. And then uh, when I just started hearing about it, about eighth grade year, and that's when I wanted to win this. What is this environment like right now? It's like everybody's on top of you. Yeah, everybody's not, right on the mat. It's, it's not a traditional yeah. arena. Um, it's loud. It's hot. Two separate gyms all weekend. Yeah. Do you, does that affect how you guys wrestle and perform a little bit, do you uh, think? I'm sure it affects some people, but I'm just so used to it. Competing at Super 32, all these events. I'm so used to the fans. I, you just, eventually you're, you learn just to shut them out. and I don't even hear them anymore, to be honest. They're just, they're just there. Uh, great to see you back healthy. Congratulations yep. again. You. All right, who's the, second, who's the first New York? Jordan Titus. Jordan Titus. Yeah. PJ Duke, Jordan Titus, Iron Man Chance from New York. Congratulations. Yeah,